everybody welcome back to my youtube channel this is jordan report and i am your host robert jordan everyone please remember to like subscribe and share okay guys we're going to continue with our local news series we're going to go back out to california the once golden state the land of my birth it is under serious attack fires blackouts homelessness california is having it rough we're going to go to the local news channel Campers arriving for the Labor Day weekend found themselves suddenly trapped by flames. The creek fire had exploded, jumping a river and cutting off the only road out of the Mammoth Pool Reservoir in the Sierra National Forest. Heidi Oriana was there with her family from North Hollywood. When people ask me, I tell them I experienced hell on earth. She says they thought they were going to die. There was a lot of people that needed help. People were getting burned. Cars were jammed. We got um, containers, plastic containers, and we started throwing water to the cars, water, so the cars wouldn't get on fire. Dennis Drake was with his family. It was the fastest growing fire I had ever even heard of, let alone seen. It was amazing. He says he and about 150 people spent over an hour in the reservoir to escape the fire. Temperance to the size of golf balls. Winds going 40, 50, 60 miles an hour. And we just keep going under and under and under. And it's like, in my mind, I'm going, okay, are we going to die from the fire? Or are we going to die from drowning? Drake captured this video of a military helicopter landing in the middle of the inferno. Whoa. <laughs> I'm going, they are here. They made it. And my level of anxiety, fear, stress just went from a million to about 10. It was just a big relief, just a huge relief. The California Air National Guard posted this picture over the weekend showing the rescued campers like Drake, who had to be packed inside the Black Hawk and Chinook helicopters, even some pets. Their video shows some of the 200 people who had to be rescued landing safely at the Fresno airport. At least two people, though, were seriously injured. Oriana says they finally got the second helicopter out. My kids didn't want to go without me. They got to a point they thought that if we were going to die, we should die together. Take a look at this video posted by Juliana Park as she frantically escaped the wall of flames in the Sierra National Forest where she had been backpacking. The 100-foot flames destroyed homes, leaving a trail of destruction as historic triple-digit temperatures combined with dry conditions helped fuel this fire. Authorities say half the town of Big Creek in Fresno County was destroyed by this fire. Governor Gavin Newsom has declared a state of emergency for the region. In the newsroom, Jasmine Veal, CBS 2 News. All right, guys, that was tonight's news in California.